had seven years ago when I started a, a camp like this with with women, and we're not afraid to talk to each other about about anything and Good. supporting each other. Yeah, that's right, that's awesome. It's amazing. Um, that just hasn't happened before. I am most excited to meet all the women and just learn from them and from the experiences that they've had and get some tips and tricks. During this, this first camp that we have, you know, what I really want them to understand and to learn about the, the sport of triathlon as well as, you know, as being in a wheelchair. A lot of these women are, are fairly new injured, you know, they're pretty much still searching, they're still trying to figure out things. I, I see a lot of learning going on, which was really the, the main reason for the camp. You know, introduce them to the sport of triathlon, give them a little bit of a path, a little bit of, a little bit of direction, so when they go back home, they can apply what they learn at the camp to their daily living. There are lots of women out there that are going to join me in triathlon, and I can't wait. I learned so much about training and nutrition. This whole camp has inspired me to be more um, like regimented and have a schedule. Knowing that all these girls, so we're all going to stay connected and that we're all going to support each other on our journeys, that's, uh, that's what I'm going to take away from this camp. That's the best thing ever. The Challenge Athletes Foundation, it's an organization that is nothing like it in the world. And to be part of this family, you will have the support pretty much for the rest of your life. Mm -hmm.